Modal Verbs Fast Review. Modal auxiliary verbs are used to express six elements in English. They are manners, politeness, ability, possibility, permission, or obligation. A modal is always used in conjunction with at least one other verb. The modal verbs are can, could, will, would, and shall, should, may, might, must, and ought. There are more modal verbs used less commonly in today's English. Have to, want to, and need to are also considered modal verbs. Modal auxiliary verbs are referred to as helping verbs and irregular verbs. Have fun with the following modal auxiliary verb examples. Can we go now? Yes, we can, or no, we cannot. Could you give me a ride tomorrow? Yes, I can, or no, I cannot. Will you come to the party tonight? Yes, I will, or no, I won't. Would you come to my party tomorrow? Yes, I will, or no, I won't. Shall we go now? Yes, let's go, or no, let's wait a few minutes. Should we go to the beach tomorrow? Yes, let's do it, or no, I can't. May I get your coat? Yes, that would be very nice, or no, thank you. We might go to the beach tomorrow. I would love that. We ought to see the doctor this afternoon. Okay, I agree. Must we go to the doctor now? Yes, we must go now. Do you want to see a movie tonight? Yes, I would like to. That's an offer. Compared to, would you like to see a movie tonight? Do you need to work tomorrow? No, I don't need to. That's an obligation. Compared to, must you work tomorrow? Do you have to meet with your boss this afternoon? Unfortunately, yes. Compared to, must you meet him today? That's a strong obligation or commitment. You must stop when the traffic lights turn red. That's a strong obligation. She must be very tired. She's been working all day today. That's a probable conclusion. You must not talk on your mobile while driving. That is prohibited. Yes, I can drive an automobile. Thanks for asking. That's an ability. I left my phone at home. Can I use yours, please? That's permission. Please stop smoking. It can cause cancer or breathing problems. That's a possibility. I used to compete. When I was younger, I could run fast. That's a past ability. Excuse me for interrupting. Could I mention something? That's polite permission. I just heard on the radio that it could rain tomorrow. That's a possibility. May I use your car tomorrow? Mine's in the shop for repairs. That's permission. It may rain tomorrow. I'd better take my umbrella to work. That's a possibility. I think your idea is great, but might I suggest an idea? That's polite permission. I might go on vacation to Mexico next month. That's a possibility. I ought to see a doctor. I have a terrible leg pain. That's sharing thoughts. You should see your accountant. It's time for taxes. That's advice. He ought to be tired after the marathon today. That's a logical conclusion. You'd better study for the exam tomorrow. You had. That's for advice. Modal verbs are followed by an infinitive verb without to. It's also called a bare infinitive. Ought to is the exception to the rule. You must go. You should see. She can eat. It can run. These are simple examples of a modal verb followed by an infinitive verb. I hope you enjoyed this fast review. Study modal auxiliary verbs daily. Practice speaking English with your friends and favorite resources. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. If you haven't already, please subscribe to our channel.